get for you? Can I have a grand chicken spicy? Medium or large meal? A large. A large meal? Yes. With a Coke? Uh, no, Coke Zero, yes. Coke Zero? Yes. Okay, is that all? That's all. Thank you, Nathan, for coming with Thanks. Thanks. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, it's in the evening now. I just came back from McDonald's, got myself a grand chicken. This is a large meal. I enjoy fries so much. So that is what I'll be having now. I was actually craving this meal yesterday and drove to McDonald's. They did not have what did they not have <coughs> oh they didn't have any fillets then i ended up having a box master so i'm just going to quickly have this um,
Hey guys, I am stepping out a bit, a bit. I need to return those dresses, those Woolies dresses, the black one and the white one. The black one, I'm returning it because I don't like how it sits. The white one, it's because it has a hole. So now it's around six. We are going to the mall. I've just had to first um, make food for the baby, change him and all of that. And I'm just quickly finishing off this smoothie and then we go out. So I'm not sure if you guys will be able to see. I'm wearing this jacket from New Balance. I'm wearing these clocks, but I'm gonna change. I'm actually gonna wear these sneakers and some lights. Yes. Yeah, that's that. Then we'll come back home. What did I want? Oh, I wanted I wanted to talk about my hair. I don't know, you guys, um, this is a sew-in. And here in front, I left my hair. If you don't know, I have natural, like, Afro 4C. And it doesn't blend, blend well with this. And also, I don't want to relax my hair, but I do enjoy sew-ins. So I'm trying to see if I can't get a wig that has a natural feel. If not, I saw this hot brush, Philips hot brush. People were saying good, were giving good reviews about it, especially for 4C hair. So I have ordered that on Take A Lot and the order will arrive on Saturday. So hopefully it's going to work for my hair too because they were giving very good reviews so I want to try that and but for now because it's late and I don't have time to actually because I have to iron this hair so I just put on this duke as a band just to cover up that hair so I just combed it to the side so that it gets covered here let me get going the vlog I still have flu but I'm back at work and it's 20 past 8 now so yesterday when I last spoke to you guys I mentioned that I am going to canal walk to return the dresses I was supposed to return return two dresses at Woolies and return another dress at legit the dress at legit it's a dress i thought i was gonna wear uh past past weekend yes when i attended a friend's birthday but i ended up not wearing it and i only wanted it for that occasion <clears throat> so it didn't work i'm returning it so i managed to return the legit dress what i did not manage to do is the woolies guys um, we passed an ice cream um, shop and my son wanted ice cream. He just didn't want that ice cream to end. When the ice cream came to an end, it was just drama on drama on drama. I'm telling you to a point where we just couldn't do anything and I decided to just leave the mall. So we went back home. I still have the dress. And the other thing, in any case, I was not going to be able to return the dresses because I want my money back. And I had left, I had forgotten my bank card. So I know at Woolies they would want your bank card to verify before they give you cash back. If you can't, um, verif if you can't give them your, the card that was used to make the purchase, then you have to take a gift card or don't do the return or do an exchange 
sorry so yeah in any case i was not going to be able to do that but i mean i couldn't go to any other shop besides just legit and at that time he was still having his ice cream so today i am just going to go to the closest woolies to take those two dresses back the and and another thing i want that money back it's because i ended up placing an order on take a lot yesterday I, I briefly spoke about it a hot brush i quickly want to go into my take a lot so i can show you guys so i had the first available um delivery date was the 2nd of september which is on saturday and i did a cash on delivery so i need to have that money this there's some money here for the dress of yesterday the legit dress and yeah by the time this gets here i need to this is the brush uh this is the brush so i actually want to see can you see on this picture one side i know that sometimes pictures do lie it's just marketing so you see how straight that hair is that is what i want for my hair and oh let me just go back i just want to read you one one of the comments so one of the comments that actually made me to buy this my afro hair is very difficult to manage and i have never wanted to use chemicals to blow it so this straightener has made stretching my hair out so easy uh so i also would i don't think i'm ready to do that um so for now i'm just gonna use that brush hopefully it gets here on saturday morning so that if i have any thing that i'll be doing saturday i'm able to make this hair look proper and uh, i'm not gonna show you i'll show you on saturday because it will still be in the same state by saturday so that's that now i've just submitted my doctor's note i've tried to attend to all the meetings that i had to cancel because i was not here for three days yeah before i start working i quickly need to make myself um pancakes yesterday i was feeling like pancakes to eat what you want as long as it's going to comfort you and you're okay with it so yesterday i just felt that i'm gonna make them today and that is exactly what i'm gonna do so for my pancakes i don't do them from scratch i buy that pre-mixed thing and that is exactly what i'm gonna be using and bear in mind for my pancakes i like having banana and this is the only banana i have i've just cut this banana this morning for my son to have it at school this is what i'm gonna be using
just finished making my pancakes. This is the final product. And now, five is knife. Left it in the kitchen. So I'm just going to enjoy my pancakes. day of the vlog I am going to end this vlog today and there's actually nothing that has happened today but because I was editing the vlog and I realized that um, I think I have enough footage to close this vlog I have a preferred time that I, I like sticking to or not going over which is I max that time the last time I vlogged was two days ago on a Wednesday and today it's Friday in the afternoon on Wednesday I I was cleaning my washing machine soap dispenser and I also did some um, laundry hand wash I just quickly wanna um, talk about the hand washing so I have a toddler for those that don't know I have a two-year-old son and he at times not a lot of the times at times um, his clothes tend to be very dirty that doesn't happen a lot but at least every week I try to hand wash all the clothes that are dirty in winter it would be the hoodies or the track tops and sometimes the track pants and in summer it would be the t-shirt so I would hand wash them. I used to actually soak a, a night before soak those clothes and then um, hand wash them the next day 
but this time I was trying the vanish powder I've been using the vanish bar soap to when I'm soaking my clothes those clothes so this time I decided to get the vanish powder for the white clothes as well as the soaking of those of, of my toddler's clothes so I was just pushing it seeing what will vanish do for these clothes so I didn't soak this time I just I, well normally I use lukewarm water so I put that <coughs> sorry I put that vanish oh, I also used the bar soap vanish as well and trust me this the powder I don't know how it works on the washing machine but for hand wash it works the the washing of the clothes itself it was not that difficult and as a result I, I managed to wash all the clothes that are, I was supposed to hand wash and put them in the washer to continue washing them, rinsing and putting in the fabric softener. So I'm happy with the vanish powder. I've been happy with the vanish bar soap. So moving forward, I'm glad that it all happened just before we got into uh, the new season, which is starting today, spring. It's the 1st of September. I'm just glad that it's all happening just before we start now because we are slowly moving into a season where he's going to start wearing t-shirts and most of his t-shirts are light um, in color and I prefer it that way because, yeah, I, I, I just prefer it that way. I don't want him to wear dark colors because I'm lazy to hand wash. No, he's going to wear dark colors because... Uh, I want him to wear dark colors or I prefer a specific t-shirt in a darker color so I'm glad that I discovered this vanish powder just before we got into the t-shirt season because it's white t-shirts it's light blue t-shirts and all of that so moving forward for all of his clothes that need hand washing I'll continue using the vanish bar soap and now I've included the vanish powder so for those that probably have toddlers or um, have kids older than mine but um, still would still be having clothes or coming home with messy clothes try the vanish powder I'm not marketing but try the vanish powder and if anyone else has any other um, washing powder that they are suggesting you can leave it in the comment section i'll try it as well and so i am just going to close off this vlog here and probably start a new one tomorrow because now the day has come to an end the only thing that i still need to do today or i want to do is to um take a bath I, i'm not too sure but i think i'll take a bath the only reason I'm not too sure is because I just had flu and I'm still recovering from from flu so I'm not sure what a bath would do but um, I'll do that if if I can and for now I'll continue working I'm also making supper um, don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and to all the new subscribers thank you thank you so much I truly appreciate each and every one of you thank you so much um we'll probably talk in the next vlog see you bye